My name is Richard De Palma. I teach here at Harold S. Vincent High School. I teach chemistry, biology, and greenhouse techniques. STEM is an amalgam of science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, and probably going to be the necessity for the future in sustainability with respect to natural resources and energy consumption. Science, technology, engineering, and mathematics are the amalgam that we'll need to produce the sustainability that the future of this planet is going to have to have. My name is Will Allen. I'm a farmer and the founder and CEO of Growing Power. And this is a very science-based kind of learning, uh, working in, uh, on a farm. They might come here at first and they don't understand it. They might think that they don't like it, but after they get involved, they really become uh, passionate about it. I think uh, our students are, this next generation is gonna be very important in terms of uh, making that happen. Because for kids to learn how, uh, learn about their food system, they have to do it in a very hands-on way that leads to, uh, I believe, academic excellence. Uh, but we must pass on and make it, make it possible for them to, uh, to learn about the food system. And right now, uh, not in all of our schools are we teaching uh, young people about our food system and what, uh, how important it is to them, but we need to start doing that. I'd say about 20 to 25 percent of the students are getting it. They're finding out that what's going on here is what's going to be going on in the future. It's fascinating to see the students generate ideas and then to be able to put an idea together and then test it. I'm a junior at Vincent High School and I am studying greenhouse techniques. I like science because it helps me learn more about my environment and what's around me. I never really got to work with fish or plants and I'm learning new things about them every day. I like science and math because it's different. It shows me something new every day. The fish, they don't like to stay still. They're hopping all around. And you gotta keep focus and make sure you get all the right measurements and the lengths of the fish. Hands-on learning is different from using a book because you're actually doing it yourself instead of reading and you actually have more fun with it.